teamwork makes the dream work, y'all. Let's check this out. Okay, we got Samba servers is talking about them there. How do we use this? And Noom for Linux, options and IP. Is there like a default if I just type in Noom for Linux and, and hit that IP? I wonder what happens. Hmm. Okay, we're getting we're getting stuff. Hey. Things are happening. When this is done, I might need your guys' help interpreting this, but. So you must run, if you run a Noom for Linux with just the IP, I must just throw a bunch of default stuff at it or everything at it. Guys, I got a new, I got a new chair. My other chair was like. My other office chair I got 10 years ago when I was a work study student at a college and one of the vice presidents was throwing out his office chair because it was beat up. I got it. I was like, hey, bro, you're throwing that in the, in the garbage? He's like, yeah. I'm like, can I just take it home? He's like, I don't care. So that's been my chair for the past 10 years. But now that I work from home, my back has been killing me. And I don't know if you guys ever see me on stream. I would randomly just start lowering <laughs> like the chair would lower automatically. So I got a new chair. There's my story for tonight. This is giving us a lot of stuff. Let's just start reading through it from the top. Okay. Let's let's grab let's grab some of this information because I don't know what I'm all gonna need. I'm, whoops, I didn't mean to do a screenshot there. Let's grab everything that might look like it will come in handy. And just jot it down in our notes. Looks like there's some info there, but no SIDs being enumerated, though. Sadly, if it could enumerate SIDs through guests, you would get 80 usernames. Hammy Z said, got to get the rollerblade casters in the office chair. Best upgrade I ever did to mine. I'll have to, I'll have to look into that. Can't get OS info. We have users here, right? We have this Andy, Andy Hissup. We have, we see there's a guest user, a built-in account for guest access, which seems to be enabled. We have these mailboxes. We have more users. Am I reading this right, guys? We're at least getting usernames here. We have a service account. Let's grab some of this stuff down. Don't know if this stuff's useful, but we'll grab it anyways. I have a feeling this is gonna be more useful stuff, these actual usernames here. Okay, we couldn't connect to the SMB, which was, you know, we already tried to do that manually. Okay. Looking at comments, if, let's see, but it does seem like there's a domain called HTP though. Yeah, there probably is since it's hacked the box. And Hammy Z said, looks like all the default admin or guest accounts are disabled, so it couldn't get the SIDs. I see, I gotcha. Attempts to map shares, password policy. 
password info for domain. So we know the domain is HTB, right? We got our minimum password length. Password complexity is disabled. Built-in groups. Built-in group memberships. We couldn't look up SIDs. Local groups. So domain guest has member HTB guest, which makes it seem like the guest account's active, right? We have these exchange servers. Hmm. You guys think that would come in handy? Bam or S X, what are you working on? So I have the title wrong. We're not doing hack the, or we're not doing try hack me. We're doing hack the box, uh, forest on hack the box. We're just, I'm going through their active directory series. But I'm a, I'm a noob, y'all, so feel free to help me out. Or if I miss something obvious, please let me know. We have these privilege IT accounts, and it has the member service account. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder if we'll end up abusing a service account. And guys, I don't even know if I'll, if I'll solve this room tonight. My goal is to st struggle bust my way through this and learn as I screw things up. We couldn't get SID, right? We already got that. Okay. So what did we learn from a Noom for Linux? What are the main things? We have the domain name and the domain SID. Host is part of a domain, not a work group. We have some of these accounts. Um, these accounts in particular stand out to me, right? Sebastian, Lucinda, we have what appears to be a service account. We have Andy, Mark, and Santi. We have domain guest has a member HTB guest. We have some exchange stuff. We have this privilege IT account, which service accounts are a part of. I'd assume this SVC Alfresco might be part of the privilege IT accounts group. Still don't have initial access though. <laughs> 